Hi everyone, happy Monday. Today was a great day to be honest because it was the first day that uh, um, the lady that we hired to help me out around the apartment came for the first time and it felt amazing. I swear, it felt so nice. I'm not even trying to brag here. You know, I'm just not feeling dead at the end of the day. I'm feeling like, okay, I'm okay. I spend uh, the entire day with uh, baby Adele, you know, doing fun baby stuff. We played with her. We went for a walk all together. The lady walked with us. Uh, we also did some grocery shopping. Uh, she cooked she cooked a proper meal for us, which was amazing. So we had, uh, you know, we had dinner and tomorrow she's going to cook some uh, beef, you know, the Asian style beef, the wok beef uh, with egg fried rice. And I'm just so excited about, you know, good food. I'm so excited that I don't have to cook anymore. I'm so grateful to have help around the house. Uh, she cleaned everything. Everything is so proper and nice. She started organizing all the shelves and everything because she was like, oh my God, this is such a mess. I'm like, yes, it is, but it's, you know, it's working for me because I know where everything is. And she's like, well, would you let me organize everything? And I'm like, yeah, sure. <laughs> Just do it. Sorry, the camera was dirty, I think. Also, the quality is so bad. Uh, she did the laundry, she ironed everything, well, almost everything, there is still a little bit of things uh, left, uh, she's gonna finish it tomorrow, but it just gives me so much time now, well, it doesn't give me a lot of time, because I still spend this time with Adele, but before it was, you know, Adele would play next to me, and I would do all of this stuff, um, but now I actually get to uh, be present in the moment, and spend this time with her, playing with her, not just watch her play um, by herself, um, but also, she's a babysitter at the same time, so um, whenever I have to uh, shoot my content, I can do that. Whenever I have to do my work, um, I can do that. I can just um, leave baby Adele with her for um, a little bit, you know, like 30, 40 minutes and just focus on my work stuff, which is amazing. I'm sure it's going to help me tremendously to move forward with, you know, all of the goals that I've set <laughs> for this year for myself. Because, um, yes, sometimes I feel like I'm not doing enough. But at the same time, um, I give myself a little bit of slack because I know I just gave birth four months ago. I am a stay-at-home mom and it's difficult, you know, to juggle everything. It's difficult to do everything by myself. That's why um, this year, uh, one of the things I wanted to learn was to delegate. And uh, I think we're getting there. Um, I'm also... Um, looking for someone who creates um, PowerPoint presentations because this is something I will also have to do for my online course and that is something that's going to take ages for me to do by myself so it's better if I just you know um, tell someone what to do give them an outline and uh, show them an example because I have a few presentations ready and uh, then I'll, I just uh, let them do the rest. I think uh, it's the smartest thing um, that uh, I can really do. But uh, yes, it's super exciting. I did not vlog today because, you know, it was her first day and I was just showing her around, showing her everything and stuff like that. So I've been kind of busy as well. But hopefully starting from tomorrow, I'll vlog more. Also tomorrow is the Valentine's Day and it is so exciting. I already have my gifts, but my husband's gift that um, I got him uh, it should arrive tomorrow. Hopefully it will arrive tomorrow. I got the confirmation. It says that it will arrive tomorrow, but there is no guarantee yet, so I really, really hope it will. Tomorrow I'll show you what he got me, but it's just super duper cute. Anyway, I'm gonna go edit the vlog from last week because I was supposed to post it today, but I did not have time, so I'll do it now. I guess I'll post it tomorrow uh, during the day. And um, yes, happy Valentine's Day. Uh, this is my gift for my husband. Five kilos of happiness and fats in my body. <laughs> and um, here is the main present. 
which I already did open and then uh, wrap back up so I can film, I don't know, maybe a reel or something or a story for my Instagram. But anyway, I'm going to show you what's inside a bit later. I hope you're having a great day. Well, I hope you had a great day. I love Valentine's Day because it's such a cute uh, celebration. The only thing I asked my husband for the flowers, I did not get the flowers. Instead, I got the massive, massive bar of chocolate that I will probably never finish eating but I guess um, we're gonna keep it for all of our guests and uh, this is gonna be the only chocolate from now on that I'm gonna eat for the entire year probably until it's gone mm, but he also gifted me something from LV something I honestly did not expect um, it was low-key a piece that I kind of wanted but I never shared anywhere, I never talked about it because I never really considered purchasing it. Um, I do like the piece, I mean, I saw it, um, my husband has it, and uh, now I have it too, and uh, I saw it on some of the influencers, and um, I really, really love the entire vibe, so I also wanted um, that piece, but I never you know i never thought of buying it myself for myself he also received the present i got him the ipad pro uh, the one he wanted 12.9 inches uh, uh, with the uh, not the folio cover but the one with the keyboard you know because um, i thought it would be a lot uh, more useful to have it with a keyboard this way he will also be able to use it as a laptop uh, for his job and uh, it's going to be a lot uh, you know easier and uh, more convenient uh, to have a keyboard as well so he's very very happy because he wanted an ipad for quite some time uh, so i'm glad he liked it you know and uh, it came right on time this morning um, although i ordered it on friday afternoon um, i just didn't think that um, valentine's day is on tuesday you know? <laughs> and i saw the delivery day it says 14th and i was like Oh, that's amazing and yesterday i was so stressed out because i did not receive the shipping confirmation yet and then uh, in the afternoon they sent me an email saying that uh, um, the parcels were sent and i checked the delivery date was uh, tomorrow and i was like oh my god this is so quick because um, everything uh, that we order on apple comes from milan it doesn't come from uh, switzerland and uh, i checked it as well this morning and it was processed in geneva at 7 a.m. and at 9 20 it was already with the delivery guy so it was like okay such a relief and he arrived at around uh, 11 11 30 i would say so perfect you know so i'm so happy you know he got it on time because i told him listen just in case it arrives tomorrow don't get mad <laughs> it will arrive um but uh, starting the day off uh, great, Adele is asleep. Um, I'm finishing the vlog, I have to post it today because I didn't yesterday. A cleaning lady that we hired is here, just organizing. She wants everything to be organized and I kind of like it about her. You know, I like when it's all organized but you need to have the time and I do not have this time but she does. So that's amazing. Hopefully she will organize all the drawers around the apartment and everything will be super clean and neat. We're still home i'm gonna finish editing and then hopefully in the afternoon we get to go outside for a walk we'll see maybe we'll take a ride uh, with adele my husband um so yeah that's the day basically <laughs> Editing the vlog, almost done. Also, I have a haircut today at 5, um, just scheduled an appointment. So I have about two hours left to finish everything and start exporting this video. Having my Bisher muesli, I honestly didn't feel like eating them, but today is the last day before expiration. So it's like, well, it's now or never. <laughs> and I felt bad throwing it away. So I had some and actually no regrets because um, it's so good. And I'm also having my tea and uh, just finished editing the vlog finally baby girl is staying with a nanny for the first time my husband is um, there as well you know just in case it's not for long though it's for about 30 minutes only i'm already done so i'm gonna go take care of her and uh, then we're gonna bounce in about an hour um go for a walk and then i have a haircut at 
down it's currently 3 30 i have a haircut at five um so that's the plan and off to a hairdresser So here's my hair now and and here's after what do you guys think i chopped my hair off <laughs> i let the hairdresser do whatever he wants to with my hair i just told him i want it short and uh, he did all the magic but i think it looks amazing i love it so much he did layers as well so it's very nice oh my god i think this is the craziest makeover ever but <gasps> I have decided to go short, but really short. I've never had my hair cut this way before. He suggested the layers because he suggested them the first time I went after my pregnancy. And I was like, no, I don't want layers. I just want it super straight. And that's what he did. That's what I had before. And this time I told him, well, listen, if you think that layers will be better, then uh, let's do it, whatever. <laughs> and... Uh, yeah he he just went for it <laughs> and uh, i like i was looking at him at the entire process and he was just chopping and chopping and chopping and chopping my hair and at one point i was like oh my god are you going a bit too far maybe we should stop but i was like oh no i trust him um i'm gonna see what he does like whatever yolo you know <laughs> and uh, when it was done i was very impressed i love it so much and he actually thanked me at the end he was like oh my god you came like a blank canvas and i got to paint without you telling me what to do and blah 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 because he said usually all the haircuts that i do are super boring because people are very limited in their head and they're like no i don't want this i don't want that this is too short and blah 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 and uh he was like i got to just you know do my thing and enjoy the process and i love i love my new hair so much i showed it to my mom she hated it and she was like who let you do that to your hair blah 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 i'm like mom i didn't ask anyone <laughs> I, I let myself do that because she loves my hair so much but you know what um i love my hair this way and uh, she's gonna get used to it and uh, my little brother he loved it as well my dad loved it as well my husband especially loved it as well uh so yeah i'm so happy i mean <gasps> isn't it cool what do you guys think anyway it's the valentine's day <laughs> it's the night already it's eight 30 i believe yeah no it's 8 50 actually uh, my husband's already asleep together with adele and uh, i'm here about to post the, the vlog i think it already exported and then i have to figure out what to do with this because it's too big i'm thinking of cutting it into uh you know the separate pieces and store them in um uh, that fridge over there so i think i'm gonna keep um everything there separately so whenever we have guests over i can easily grab one giant piece and then you know break it into smaller pieces and serve it for everyone to have with uh, some tea for example uh so that's the plan but it's ginormous i have to do it tonight and uh, also since um everybody asleep um i was thinking maybe i can film a video maybe i can film two videos i have my makeup on i have my hair done so i'm pretty much ready to go i just have to you know change the top and that's it nobody sees my bottom so i'm gonna stay in my pjs probably but um if i have enough time i would happily film the two videos now so i don't have to worry about them um later you know i'll just have to edit them and uh yeah i also want to have some tea but i'm going to export the video first probably have some tea then and film the videos i guess so i already cut all of this and uh, yeah we have still four left All is done <laughs> we have all the little pieces um, over here 
so now i'm gonna put them all in this um little you know it's uh, supposed to be the wine whoops it's supposed to be the wine uh, fridge but uh, we just store um, all of our drinks in here you see we have some coke and uh yeah <laughs> random things but i'm gonna put everything in here in the empty gaps and uh yeah i guess that's how we'll store this chocolate hi everyone we have the lunch ready so yum happy uh, Wednesday it is such a beautiful weather outside I posted a vlog and uh, uh, it's a bit late because I was supposed to do it on Sunday but whatever and uh, tomorrow we have a new video going live and it's um, the Valentine's presents I'm gonna show you everything that I gifted to my husband and then what he um, gifted to me but we're now on a walk outside the weather is freaking beautiful um, it's the three of us with Adele I still cannot get over my new haircut. I think it's just so good. And also my hubby uh, took a few pictures just now and they just look so much better than with long hair. I just love it so much, this haircut. Um, baby Adele is in the new prom. So she used to have the, like, you know, the baby bassinet. I don't know how you call it in English, but uh, she would lay there and that's it. It's like all covered from all the sides. Basically what she said before in the vlogs, uh, this time we have decided to take the one that you start using when the baby is older but I mean you can use it from birth I guess but it's not as comfy I would say as uh, the bassinet one uh, for the little little babies but now since she wants to you know sit up a little bit more already she's four and a half months she's very curious to see what's around her uh, she just loves you know to watch everything and being in that bassinet not being able to see anything she hated it so much she was crying and screaming inside of it so today we took out the new one and uh, she's already awake and she's just loving it so much uh, she can stare around she can look at the people and uh, she's very calm so freaking amazing I'm in H&M because um, I want to go to the kids section it's upstairs and uh, look for a new hat for baby Adele because the one that she has now is a bit too big for her and it always gets in her eyes and she hates it so much and um, I was thinking maybe I can find something that would fit her now something not too expensive the other time I got a beanie from Tartine Chocolat and uh, it became so small so fast and uh, it was really expensive so this time I just want to buy something inexpensive but with all the can you see summer clothes I don't know if I'll be able to find a beanie hmm. Let's see. Oh my God. So many cute pieces. Oh, this is so cute. Imagine me in my Frankie shop, quilted jacket like this, and her in something like this. That would be so cute for spring. So mama did some damage for the baby, but I just found so many cute little pieces. I could not resist. I got them for six to nine months, so 74 centimeters and um, it should be fine. I also want to do some, you know, shopping for myself, but no, I'm not going to because my baby's outside with a nanny and uh, yeah, some other time. But at least I get to do this, you know, at least I get to come and just uh, buy a few little things for her when I need to. Because with baby Adele, it's a bit stressful. But they have so many cute things over there. I need to check the website first, see what I like, and then come and uh, look for the pieces in store so I can try them. Okay, we're back home and I want to show you what I got her. So, this is just something, you know, very little for 74 centimeters. She's now 68, that's what she wears. Um, but her size is around 60. 260 no even bigger i think maybe 64 um but she already wears 68 this is for 74 so it's uh, you know a pack of three then you know how much i love denim so i found this denim piece uh so it's this um 
you know, little shirt uh, with jeans. I thought it was so freaking cute and adorable. And I feel like this one is all, no, this one is for eighty. Uh, so for nine to twelve months, and uh, this she'll be she'll be able to wear. I feel like in May, June, especially in the evenings when it's still a bit chilly. But this is very thin, so it's perfect for summer. That's why I didn't go for a smaller size. Then I got her um, a pair of jeans, and this one's a seventy-four to wear together uh, with uh, the sweater. It has a letter A for Adele, uh, which is so cute, but that's not it. I got her this jacket. I have decided to go for it. It's just so freaking cute. And, you know, together with the sweater and the jeans, but that's not all. To complete the look, we got the sneakers as well. And uh, this is just so freaking cute. And I cannot wait to see her in... Uh, all of this. Hello, happy Thursday. Um, I'm now outside. We're actually waiting for our nanny. Uh, she went to the bathroom really quickly and I'm here with baby Adele. Uh, but the weather is really nice. It's around 12 degrees today, but still in the shades. It's um, kind of cold, you know, a little bit. Uh, I do not vlog much at home, but uh, we're now in town. I'm looking for a few things here. I was looking for a few things for my brother, didn't happen, couldn't find them. And uh, now I just need a few things for my husband, for baby Adele and uh, for myself. So I'll do that very quickly because she's not asleep and for now she's not crying. But you never know, you know. <laughs> um, so I should be uh, quite quick, but she's falling asleep now. So hopefully she'll fall asleep and uh, this will give me a little bit more time to um, Do everything I need basically a new video just went live um, a few hours ago. I, I believe I posted it and uh, Yeah, super excited. I also shared my new haircut yesterday on Instagram and um, I received so many amazing messages <laughs> So thank you so much for that um, but otherwise all is good, uh, all is fine. Um, I have a lot more energy having a nanny now. I feel like I have a lot more energy to do stuff and uh, a lot more time and freedom as well. And it feels amazing. You know, yesterday I was dancing with Adele just because I was in the mood and I had the energy. And um, I love this version of myself for her. I don't wanna be an exhausted mom for her. You know, I don't want her to see me as always tired and uh, not in a mood and stuff like that so um yeah we left town going uh, home because uh, it's time i found what i was looking for i ordered a bra i bought some bibs for adele the plastic one because she's eating solid foods now and uh yeah on the way back home so you know i've been doing uh, my visual scores it's visuals and basis of smm you know social media marketing and it's quite fun i really like it but it's really tough to do social media when we are now learning the copyright part you know to write uh, text for posts and uh, scripts for reels and stuff like that and i feel like i am the worst at storytelling that's really my weakness before i used to post um stories just to post them you know they weren't about anything they were just the random ones and now i'm trying to you know do the story tell uh whenever i post my stories so we have a connection you know my audience and i and uh, you get to know me a bit better because uh, it's important you know when you're building your personal brand i feel like it's very important um to be honest with your audience so people can trust you it takes uh, i feel like it takes your blog on a different level and uh, it's not like i lied before but i feel like i could never be someone who talks beautifully i would say who writes amazing captions you know long captions telling um, some story and that was definitely my weakness and uh, now I feel like I really have to um, try and work harder on it. Um, and I'm thinking of starting to uh, write a plan for my stories uh, for a week maybe or 
every night before going to bed for the next day this way it's definitely 100% a lot easier to post stories because um, you have a structure you have a plan and you stick to the plan you know what you're gonna say you know what you're gonna post uh, so maybe this is what I should be focusing on right now I have no idea I really don't know what I'm doing <laughs> but i'm trying my best and i want to share as much as i can here with you in the vlog um because it really is important to me it's like you know a passion project of mine that i just really enjoy doing hi everyone happy friday uh we're about to eat lunch so i'm now you know warming up some food we have uh, this dish uh, with the chicken so good but I wanted to show you yesterday I got a little this beep because she's now eating solid foods and the one she has is the fabric one and it's very difficult to maintain you know it also leaves a lot of stains you know especially if it's something colored like uh, a carrot for example it leaves orange stains and the bibs are white um, so I have decided to buy her this one and there is another one in a it's like mixture of fabric but the fabric that's um, kind of rainproof like waterproof um, but we tried this one today and honestly she hated it so much i feel like this uh, thing is uh, is not very soft it doesn't sit nice on her neck and uh yeah she was just crying and screaming so bad because of this so i wouldn't really recommend it it's from baby bjorn um it's the the same brand as the bouncer i mean the idea is cool you can you know, machine wash it and everything but at the same time it's just not very comfortable for the baby i guess so we're gonna have lunch now and uh then i'm not sure if i should put adele to sleep now here at home or if we should just go um uh to town because there's something i need to pick up um what they were gonna order it for me but uh, they actually found it in stock uh, so i have to go and pick it up now um it's nothing <laughs> it's nothing big it's nothing like designer or anything it's uh uh, you know some bra for me <laughs> i have to do some work on my computer have to film a few things so i'm not sure if i'll be doing that today or maybe during the weekend um i think it's better to stay this weekend with adele and then plan everything ahead and so next week i can start because we have the nanny during um working days only uh we asked her to come on saturdays as well but I'm not sure if it's fair you know um so i feel like this weekend will be alone and uh, starting from monday um i'll just give her a doll and uh, i'll be able to um you know um, have some work time for me you know i can finally film things and i can finally work um on the course that's freaking amazing Happy Saturday everyone, we are in town, I uh, came uh, because I need to pick up uh, a little something from the store for myself, Adele is here asleep, she was crying like crazy because she wanted to sleep but uh, you know she really uh, needs to be on the move to fall asleep you know so either in a stroller or we have to jump on a bouncing ball that's how she falls asleep and uh, in the car it just wasn't enough movement so i'm now with her uh she's fully asleep <laughs> she's so cute in her new jacket uh, but hopefully she'll sleep the entire way there we're going to new on today it is a beautiful saturday and uh, we just really want to spend it on the lake you know walking around taking photos and just enjoying um the weekend but uh yes hope you're having an amazing day as well and uh talk to you in a bit and here we are we don't have this view in geneva my husband's carrying adele because she's not in the mood
we're back from uh, our little um, road trip to Nyon. It was very, very nice. The weather was super amazing, but then it got really, really cold. But we had some filet de perche, and I'm going to post a picture. I think I forgot to vlog it even. <laughs> I forgot to film it. But we came back home, and I lost an earring. So you see, I have two earrings over here. I changed them. So um, these ones were the custom-made ones um, with the little diamonds. And the one that I lost is i'm gonna show you so it's one of this the little diamonds so i had the, the two studs uh one and the other i was changing just now and i realized that i lost one of them and now um my husband is helping me find it i hope it's somewhere here somewhere home you know where i changed otherwise i have no idea but uh, I felt like the closure wasn't strong enough for a while already, but I didn't do anything about it. It was fine. And uh, yeah, I lost it. So I really do hope that I will find my second earring. Otherwise, I'm going to have to wear this one only, the little hoops. Another reason I actually wanted to go to Nyon or somewhere else <laughs> than Geneva is because I wanted to take some photos. Uh, you know, I'm doing my uh, aesthetics and visual course, um, but it's coming to an end. Uh, so my last uh, lesson, my last uh, course will be... Um, I feel like next week and next week I actually have to uh, submit my final work and I have to create a feed of 12 pictures for myself but also for a brand and this is <laughs> the problem because I haven't contacted any brands just yet but there is one place on my mind because they invited me um, <clears throat> to you know try uh, um, to try out their cuisine and everything so I'm very curious to go like I was supposed to go a few weeks ago but uh, I couldn't and uh, now I think I might actually go on Monday maybe on Tuesday probably on Monday this way I will have more time and I will offer them uh, to create you know 12 pictures for their Instagram if they're interested um, and um, I can submit my final work <laughs> You know, it's very important because otherwise I will not get um, my certificate. And it's already about the certificate, but still, you know, since uh, I did the course, I did all the homeworks, it's such a pity, you know, not to get one just because I didn't want to take pictures for somebody else. And of course, I'm not going to charge um, that place because it's going to be my initiative and uh, I... I need it. It's not like they asked me to do it for them, but I need it. And maybe in the future, if if they like the result, um, I could potentially start uh, working with them as well. Who knows, you know, <laughs> the direction uh, it's going to take me. But uh, I still need to contact the owner of the place and, uh, you know, ask him if uh, he's down to do it with me or not. And... Um, um also we did take a few pictures for me uh because my feed is changing you know the um direction of the color palette i would say and i do that every once in a while so before i would say my feed was more of uh you know the very neutrals and like a lot of beige colors and like lighter colors um now um i wanted to move more towards green because uh you know spring is coming and uh, um i just like green <laughs> so you know, we did take a few pictures i wore my uh frankie shop uh, green jacket and it's very important you know to plan your outfits even if you um do these types of things full time because you have to think about the color everything has to work together otherwise it's a little bit more complicated to um you know plan uh, the pictures to post so that's what we did uh, in neon basically but <sighs> we only took like a few pictures you know it wasn't all about the pictures and uh, i'm about to start editing this vlog because it's already six and uh it's getting late 